Gareth, what was your first reaction when you heard the news about receiving this award? I mean, no, I just, you know, I couldn't believe it. You know, being named the winner, picked out of the, that group of eight finalists, you know, it was great. I was actually over at my mom's house having dinner, and so I was able to celebrate that with her, and, you know, it was fun fun to hear that first celebrating, so. You know, offensive line is all about the team, but what does this award say about the strength, not only UB program, but maybe the strength of your uh, entire offensive line? Right, you know, I think it's something that uh, the coaching staff always has taken a great pride in, you know, recruiting good athletes, at the offense and defensive line positions, and I think it says, you know, this team, this team's always kind of been built around stopping the run and being able to run the football. So I think it says a lot about the success that we've had over the years that we've had good uh, interior linemen. I think it's something that we can take a lot of pride in. And one of the perks of winning this award is, of course, you get that invitation to the East-West Shrine Game. Mm -hmm. What does that mean to you? You know, I think it's just uh, at Division Two. You know, it's all about if you're trying to continue to play football, it's all about exposure. So I think it's something that you know I have that week to play with uh, you know a little better competition and with guys that uh, are all trying to do the same thing and compete in front of those NFL scouts. So. And then you're graduating uh, later this week from UMD. And uh, so what are your plans for the immediate future with? professional football and working with agents and right. obviously preparing for this. Season. You know, the, the plan right now is just kind of work out for uh, around campus here and uh, maybe down the Twin Cities before this uh, East-West Shrine game. And then after that, I'll probably find a gym down the Twin Cities area, maybe that ETS and uh, train there and uh, hopefully get into a training camp somewhere and go from there.